Half a day. My name is David Krasosimo with the Pacific Daily News. Thank you for joining our 1940 Census project. This is a searchable database of 1940 Census information provided to you by the Pacific Daily News. Today, I'd like to walk you through how to use the database. As you read through our SUMI series this weekend and beyond, you'll be able to find a search module in every story that allows you to search the original 1940 census documents. These were the documents released by the Census Bureau at the time. Uh, please look for this search module that allows you to search by first name, last name, and by village. Again, you can type in uh, the last name, the first name, or both. Partial names are okay for this database. Uh, you can select the village uh, to narrow the search or leave it to none to see island-wide results. And if you can't find the person that you're looking for, you can try entering a partial name because of possible misspellings in 1940 or during the data, the data entry process. Uh, so for today's search, we're going to uh, do a test uh, for the last name Camacho, and we're going to search in the village of Aganya. So again, I've put Camacho as a last name and I'm searching in the village of Aganya. We're gonna click on search. And you'll see that it pulls up the results for all the Camachos listed in Aganya in the area of Padre Palomo. This is Anna Camacho, 24, living in the village of Aganya in the area of Padre Palomo. Please pay special note to the page number. So this person, Anna Camacho, is listed on page 10A. You'll see here the linking PDF. This is the original document. So we're going to click on that. So this is the actual census form that was filled out back in 1940. Again, we've searched for Anna Camacho, and she is on page 10A. When you go back to the census documents on the upper right-hand corner, you'll see the page number, sheet number 1A. Again, the person that we searched for is on page 10A. So we would scroll down and look for sheet number 10A. Now we'll be making enhancements to this database soon that will allow you to search more easily using tags with people's names. And once that enhancement is available, we'll make sure our readers are informed and that we update the database. So again, we're looking for Anna Camacho on sheet number 10A. And here we go. This is sheet number 10A. And as we scroll down the sheet, we find Anna R. Camacho, female, 24, again in the village of Aganya in the Padre Palomo area. We encourage readers to please download uh, the census documents. We encourage you to share on your social networks, on Facebook, on Twitter, tag your family, your friends. Uh, this is a resource uh, that is free and open to the community of Guam, uh, and we hope that you find it useful. Again, we will be making enhancements shortly, fairly soon, and once those enhancements are ready, that make it easier to search uh, using names and tags, uh, will inform our readers. Again, this is a project of the Pacific Daily News. If you want to search again, there's a button here that allows you to search again. You click on that button and it will take you back to the search module. If you have any questions about the 1940 Census project, feel free to email us at news at guampdn.com. Again, that's news at guampdn.com or call us at 479-0404. Again, that's 479-0404. Again, this is David Chrysostomo from the Pacific Daily News. Thank you for reading the PDN.